Alright, today we have another lesson which is uh, if you don't do the head cleaning in the morning before you start printing what will gonna happen is sometimes the white will not come out so with this kind of printing you can see here there's no white that covers the color and here it's printing without the white in cover so because of that that it's uh because the white normally settles down settles in the morning so all you have to do is shake these things so how to shake this is just like this so that uh, we can you can do the head cleaning so that whatever white that was stuck in there, it will be flushed out. So when you start to print, so it will... So here in the start, there's no white that came out. But now it started to... getting out there, but it's still... Uh, not so white. Because the problem with the white ink, it settles. But it's better than DTG, you know? Because the DT ink are so... fine with the... Pigment, so it will not really cause a major blood on the heads every now and then. Now it's starting to print the white, but that is so light because it still start to push the, the white ink that is uh, still already. So, well, you can still make use of this uh, printing if you are putting it in the white uh, shirt because uh yeah you can still put the powder on it you can salvage this uh heat transfer but you can only, uh, only put this in the white shirts so that's one thing that you need to shake it and after you shake the this one shake like that cleaning it so that you will flush the, the white that settled down and our printers it came from a cloud so we have this thing here see we have that hose that goes to the waste tank this is a waste tank so this is the hose and I have a black milk gallon there you know, to push to, to put all this thing that ink that is you know, wasted already and after that I will just throw it away and put the new one you know because we have a lot of bacon for that so this is one of the innovation that uh, MacLeod printers did so again this printer is a new printer which is uh, we have two model right now for Epson L1800 I'll explain it to you for the next video but uh, this is my the lesson that I'm trying to share to you every day before you start any printing so that you will not waste one of it is try to shake it do the head cleaning or nozzle check sometimes to verify that your nozzle is all correct so that you can align it so that uh, you print it's precise and you don't miss any color but the white in order for white to get out then what you're gonna do is do the head cleaning okay that's all for today and see you in the next lesson